All I need is just a little drink with an umbrella in it and a hammock, and I'm golden. All here, right. Here, Katie. All right. Yeah, you and I think very much alike, Rahel. Let's take a look at Storm Scan 3. Nice wide zoom, very, very active pattern at the moment. You've got a lot of moisture working its way in across the southeast, and some of that's lifting in already through Virginia. That's eventually going to head our way later on today, and especially toward nightfall in the overnight, and especially for the southeast half of our region. Let me show you future weather. So we're taking you all the way to 1 p.m. By this point, some of you, we even have some sunshine. So this is truly a split forecast. North and west, it's not a bad day. But later on tonight, as early as evening, there will be some showers that start to fire up. It may be a little sooner than this, but generally it's toward nightfall and then overnight. This is how things sort of pan out here. The batch of rain really just works its way through the southeast half of our area and then lifts out of here by about the same time tomorrow. So there may still be some wet weather to dodge as you're hit, hitting the road here tomorrow. Now it should be clearing out. We'll end up with some sunshine for the rest of your Wednesday, but this is another system in the pipeline of several down the road. So come tomorrow again, skies are going to start to clear after those morning showers. Hours. By Thursday, though, more rain and thunderstorms from another system. On Friday and Saturday, not bad at all, but I can't rule out some showers returning as early as Sunday.